Hello today, and today we're going to have a game of Head Over Heels on the Sinclair ZX Spectrum, and this is the 128K version. Now, I originally played this back in the day on my friend's Commodore 64. It was one of those games I didn't mind, even though it was an isometric game, so I'm not really keen on isometric games, but this was one of those games... We had a lot of fun playing back in the day. It was frustrating, but it was um, a good game. Um, right, so I also reviewed this on the CPC. It was quite nice, actually. Nice and colourful. Um, Amiga, and there was a PC remake. But not played it on the Spectrum yet, so let's have a look. Right, so keys, choice, right, let's have a look. Now it's got this John Rittman menu style right because it was written by John Rittman and Bernie Drummond right I think it uses the same game engine as the original Batman game right didn't play that back in the day on any system right play the game select the keys right now you can obviously read redefine your keys or redefine your keys I should say and then there's quite a few keyboard commands or keyboard controls I should say right so if we push space so we can what is it no that's that's going on push enter so left oh fuck it I don't I don't like the fact that you can pick multiple keys because now I want to do that again. I want to do that again and just push. Then return. Then push space. Push return or enter. P. Push enter. Push space or whatever. Um, up. Push return. Q. Push enter. Push space. Push enter. A. So we got our directional keys set up now. Right. Jump. Now, what would I want for jump? I'm probably going to use space because you would be using jump more than any other command. Right, set of left, right, up and down, you know. No, we'll use that space. Right, carry. Um, one. Um, fire. We we'll use a fire. No, I'm not going to use M. Right, enter. We'll use enter. Right, and swap key. Oh, fucking hell. Do that again. Space. Right, now swap key. Two. So that swaps between head and heels. You don't play with both characters at the same time you've got to use one or the other and you will be using both characters in this game at some point both have their strengths and weaknesses right why has that gone to right don't matter right let's get out of this push shift so we've gone over f almost four minutes into this review and we ain't even started fucking about with our keys right okay now we can adjust the sound let's just make sure that we got full sounds because this is the 1 to 8k version lots of it we're gonna have lots of it you can adjust your sensitivity but we're going straight into the game could never get any well we did get as far as joining the two up but could never complete the first level. Oh fuck. Hang on, have I done this right? No, I fucking ain't. Yes, I have. Yes, I have. Right, so... That thing up there is an extra life. And getting it is a fucking bastard. 
you know what I'm not gonna fucking bother with that I'm not gonna bother that's an extra life it's only a review so that's a teleporter so both characters get eight lives each and basically if one runs out of life you might as well end the game because you need both head and heels to complete this game right so right advantages with head which we're completely complete which we're com which we're controlling now right he can pick stuff up without a aid of a bag ah shit right so we've got to switch this switch and also what a head can do and jump higher shit no I think I've reversed Q&A oh shit now I've got to fucking switch that switch again yeah so head can jump higher right so no 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 oh, you bastard but he runs slower than hills so pushing that switch turns that off but it stops those other two from disappearing when you tread on them up here so that would have disappeared if I didn't pull that switch and so did that one right that's better so now we can fire now we've got donuts we can actually fire I think or do I need the other thing right oh now this is gonna kill you so you got to get your jumping spot on here right let's have a look up here Oh fucking this is why I don't like isometric games. Because it's really hard to judge. Right, okay. So can I jump over that? Yeah. Oh! Right, that's, that platform's gonna disappear, so oh fuck it. So you need to jump because that would disappear. Alright, nothing to see here. Yeah, so it looks well, pretty much all the versions I've played look similar to each other. They all look pretty similar. Out of the 8 bit versions, I think the CPC had the most colour. Even the Commodore 64 looked monochromic, actually. Right, that's an extra life in there, but I'm not even going to attempt it because I'll probably lose my lives trying to get it. Right, so we need this. Right, so now we're going to have to build a, a stairway. Can I click that? Oh, fuck it! Right. 
All right, so I should be able to pick up. No, I can't pick up because I need, I need something to pick up with. I think I need the bag. Right, so we'll just swap over. Have a look at hills. Right, so first things we need to do. What? Ah, oh, what? That fucking kills you. Right, get on that teleporter. So, hills can move faster, but the disadvantage is he can't jump no way as high as head. Right, so what's here? All oh, right, so I'm gonna have to get on that. Oh, fuck it, hell. Right, here we go, on it. So that's gonna take us up somewhere. So that's a conveyor belt. So you need to keep jumping. Right, so... Now I don't, the problem is I don't think I can pick up yet. Right, now I can pick up. If I get that bag over there, I can pick up. Right, so what I've got to do is use this remote control. Ah, wait a minute, I need that. That's what I need to do. I need that thing. Oh, fuck. There's a little... Because I fucking fucked up the controls. Right, so I need to push that. Get that um, in the right space. Maybe there. I think now I've got to also jump on that robot as well so I've got to position him properly so I can get the bag I... done it so now I can pick up oh fuck it that's all right, I've already got it. I've already got the bag, so I don't need to worry about that. So now, I push one. Now I've collected it. I don't know what that is. I think that kills you. Just don't want to touch that. So now, push one again. Oh, fuck. Hey, I can't, still can't jump up. Do I have to, do, do I have to get that? Right. Oh, right, so I've collected something else. Right, so, okay. Right, let's pick that back up. And let's move this into position. Oh, no. So do I have to walk out of it? Because I fucked that up, don't I? So that sort of resets the room. So if we go out and come back, come back in, it resets the room. Obviously, I've already picked out the bag, so I don't have to worry about that. Right, that's in position. So now what I have to do is pick this up. Now I'll be able to get out. Push, jump. Here we go. Shit. Oh, fuck off, fuck off, fuck off, fuck off. I think he chases you around the fucking room. He's going to fucking get me. I'm going to miss my fucking lift, so... If he touches you, you're dead. Right, can I get on this? Can I get on this? Yes. Up yours. Right, okay. Right. No, oh, another one of these things, so move one into position, pick one up. Nice oh, Andy. Right, 
Oh, hi. Oh, hang on. So that will give me an extra life. And there's another one of these fucking... So I'll have to outsmart him. Uh, what do I do? Get on the lift. Or get the extra life. I think... It, I don't know if it gives you just one. Oh, fucking hell. Piss off. I'm going to get it. Oh, it doesn't give you an extra life. It gives you... I think it gives you the ability to jump higher. No. No. You fuck. I've missed a lift. Come on. Come back. Come back. Come on. Oh, I'm too far away. Can I get on it? Ah. Oh, see, I don't want to waste those jumps. Miss it again. Oh, got it. Got it. Got it. Hang on. Oh no! Bastard! Now I'm gonna miss it again. Oh, you fucker. You absolute bastard. Oh, that's not fair. Come on down. Right, here we go. Can we get on it this time? Yes. Oh no! Fucking bastard! Come on, come on! Where's that lift? Come on! I'm wasting these fucking jumps now. Right, how far is that going to take me up? Oh, come on! That's a bastard! See, this is why I have a problem with isometric games. It's really hard to judge. Oh, I didn't want to... You bastard. No, now he's going to get in my fucking way. Right, you bastard. Stop getting in my way. You absolute bastard. No, he's well out of my... Ah. Oh. Oh, just keep going left and right. Right, can I get on that? Come on! Oh. So that thing disappears when I... Just jump again! Jump again! I push space bar! Fucking hell! This is a bastard! Oh, for fuck's sake. Gee, this game will get very frustrating. And that fucker's in my way. Done it. I pushed. Oh, come on, this is ridiculous! And I'm out of the. Oh, come on, now I'm out of fucking. Oh, what? So I've got one more life with both characters, so. If you lose a life of one, you might as well just call it quits. So we ain't gonna be able to see the joining of both characters, I doubt. Right, hang on. Done it. After all, on my last lot. Oh. oh. Oh, shit. So that's it. This game over with that character. So we cannot complete the game. I can't move that. Uh. Ah, oh, what? Yeah, once again. <laughs> now, it's a good version. Don't get me wrong. It is a really good version on the Spectrum. I would definitely say it's just as good as the Commodore 64 version to play. Um, but it's an isometric game, and I'm not one of the best lovers of isometric games. Um, but this is one I did like. And on the Commodore 64, I was playing it on my mate's Commodore 64, actually. Yeah, it was, um, it was a good game. I mean, the Spectrum version's very playable. Um, graphics are nice. You know, so... 
absolutely no problem with the Spectrum version whatsoever. It's like all the other versions. It's isometric and they frustrate the fuck out of me. Anyway, I'm going to end this now. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, and goodbye.